What is going on people? Welcome back to my channel. The start of the season is finally here. I've been waiting so long for it to come around and I'm super excited for this video. This is the first match day vlog of the season. This year I'm going to be showing you all sorts from the ups to the downs and absolutely everything in between. So if you haven't subscribed, now's a really good time to do so. So you can join me on this journey. So whether you're new around here or you're one of my day ones, last season didn't go 100% to plan. We fell just short at the very last hurdle in the League One playoff final at Wembley against London. So to kick this season off, I'm actually gonna give away the shirt that I wore in the playoff final. I don't know if you can see there. The print says Sunderland v Wickham, Saturday 21st of May, Wembley Stadium. Gonna get rid of it, give it away to one of you guys, along with the boots that I wore all last season. If you're size 12, you're buzzing because you could wear them. If not, you may just want to keep them. So for a chance in winning, all you've got to do is be subscribed and leave a comment down below. So anyway, on to this season. Looking to put things right last season. Um, on a personal note, achieved most of my goals. Got into a couple of the team in the seasons. Scored five goals, had a pretty good season all round, and the only thing that I didn't make happen was get promoted to the championship. So we're going to try and go one better this year. Had a really solid off season as well, albeit ours was a little bit shorter than everyone else's because we pretty much did go to the end of May for the playoff final. I was able to get in pretty much everything I set out to do specifically focused on agility work, strength training, a lot of speed stuff over the summer. There's three weeks of warm weather training out in Dubai. Lucky me, eh? So right now, I'm probably physically in the best shape that I've been in in a very, very long time. Mentally refreshed, recharged, got no niggles, injury free, nothing to nurse or manage. So let's get to the training ground, get in the dressing room, and get this day started. Oh, hello, mate. Hello, mate. You can have anise on toast again today, Jasper. Huh? Yeah, it's going to be 3 0 after today. 3 0. 3 0. 3 0 between me and Connor as well. <laughs> no, I think that's it. If I can't get around me. If I get up these training clips, bro, you won't be doing what YouTube anymore. Just get caught with that. You're going to say. He's not comfortable on the camera, is he? Do you mind? Oh, don't blow me, bro. I don't like this shit. Man. Moving like Dumani. Ali Al Hamadi. Big season for you, bro. Iranian, Iraqi beasts, northerners. Bananas, come on, Watch out. Professional. Quickest guy at the club. Yeah. <laughs> Absolute nimble. Quickest guy at the club. Yeah, yeah. Before he met club. Yeah, no, no, no. <laughs> Wait for the uh, ice machine to fill up. Get in the ice bath. First time this season. Hello, my fellow <laughs> Rupa. <laughs> <laughs> On a Friday, strains are always lower. Just to give us a good chance in being fully recovered going into the game. Yesterday, yeah, half the squad's on whoop now, which is really good. So we can all compete and compare our recoveries 
hits each other. And it's decent because obviously everyone's trying to push to have the highest recovery score. So ultimately you're going to be trying to live a healthier lifestyle. If anyone wants to jump in our group, I'll leave a link down below and be a part of it. This season, I'm actually changing up my diet a little bit. I'm trying to keep it as anti-inflammatory as possible. So I've been on it now for about four weeks and I've been feeling a lot less stiff this pre-season. I don't know if it's because of the diet or just the time off I've had. Grimmer, you right there? No phones in the canteen, that is a fine. <laughs> that is a fine. What's the fine for a calm night? Everyone's seen this, it's not on the fine list. That's a fine. What's the fine for a calm night? Jack Grimmer, 100 quid, first fine of the season, love it. So I've actually been moving away from a lot more of the common foods that you see people eat before a match day. Pastas, tomatoes, potatoes. And actually just been trying to focus on foods that are anti-inflammatory. Oh my god. 9.84 meters per second. You've never seen them numbers. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. Yesterday in training, I, I ran 9.84 meters per second. No, you didn't. Anish. No, you didn't. That's not got above 9.34. You fraud. Sully, very quick. And Connor, the quickest in the spot. What's the top speed this season? 10.01. Why are you pulling base? You're quick. You're quick. You're quick. But you, on the other hand, Snell. You told him he was going to get more goals than me last year. What happened? Who's, who's got more goals this season already? I'm on two. How many are you on? I'm top goal scorer right now. Beetroot shot for dessert. I've won them now and also another one later. First game of the season, probably going to be blowing, I reckon. Um, you can do all you want in pre-season, but when it comes to actual competitive games, first couple of games, a lot of people get really tired and beetroot shots just help carry the nitrates around your body better. You feel less fatigued. I poured some ice into the ice bath. I'm just waiting for it to cool down a little bit. This has actually been out of action all pre-season. It's because in pre-season, having ice baths is pretty much cheating. You want to let your body recover naturally so you can actually make physical gains, become stronger, quicker, whatever it may be. But now the season has come around. You want to be feeling as fresh as possible going into each game. So I'm going to wait to see if this gets down to below 12 degrees. If not, I'll do one at home. Brent's very tired, did a lot of ball striker this week. I actually filmed with Kieran Brown, if you know him. Got a video pending. Stay tuned for that one. Subscribe if you haven't already, it'll be a good time. So, because that video is going to come out soon. Why are you piping up again? Right now. Huh? Look at that. I'm absolutely in killing my views. And look, were you not. Was it you that was marking me today when I scored in training? What, is that when I ripped you? Is that what you're going? This is when I fin put it in the top bins against your team. Oh, Jasper was marking me. Yeah, Mark. I reckon I'm offside. We'll pull up the video. We'll pull up the video. Yeah, we'll pull up the video. You're marking me. You look, man. And I stuck it in the bins. Get my breakfast this morning. We've got porridge. Blueberries, almonds, some honey on the sides, anchovy fillets. Now, last season, I was already been having uh, a carbohydrate that was higher in glycemic index with similar thing, blueberries for the hit of fruit, almonds for the fat, and either some turkey slices or chicken slices on the side. For the proteins, and while I was feeling very energetic going to games, I actually saw a specialist in the off-season who said to me that too much of uh, the high glycemic index carbs were actually causing an inflammatory response um, in my system. Did a whole load of blood tests on me. And actually said for me, the way forward is probably to sacrifice some of that energy and liveliness and actually go with uh, foods that are lower in glycemic index because they won't trigger any of that inflammatory response. So I'm gonna give this a go this season, see how I get on. It's gonna be a bit mad seeing as I'm eating anchovies for breakfast, but we'll see how it goes. Jay, set me. Jack! Jack! We're off the block. Jay, get round. 
Jay! Jay, look out! Josh, Josh, when we go down that side, Jack, Ty, I'm round, you do the other striker. Jack, shift over, Jack. The biggest. Bochi. JJ! JJ Kai! Kill it, Jay! Jay, Jay! JJ, for the goal kick, come over, yeah? Alright, you stay there, Josh. I'm left, Josh! This side. In case it overhits it, Jay. You run off Bochi. Yeah, you go that side. I'll go this side in case it overhits. Hey, make sure you're high. Hey, stay high. Grim around. Rest. Watch this is rolling, yeah? Watch, watch, watch. He's not looking. He's not even looking. Josh, got a long throw, Josh, got a long throw. George, get there! Wills! George, George, lock in. Josh, here. Jack, here, look. How is it going, Jack? Oh, you yeah, excellent. Well done, man. What do you do? You come in straight away, look at the scores, other teams. End of season, end of season. End of season. Look at How bad has he got? <laughs> oh are we at the top of the league, first day. Are we, are we top? 3-0 surely. I'll tell you that. We are top of the league. Top of the league, love it. Clean sheet, three points, three goals, can't ask much more. Tyler, debut, MOM. Don't know how. Don't know how, mate. I think I'm real. Full of confidence, love it. Oh. All our 1v1's paid off, yeah? You know you can do that to me when you did to that guy, so yeah. go on the outside, left foot finish. There's no way, there's no way you train it. I'm gonna put a training clip up right now when you try to go around me. I know, I don't have that. But, you're on stuff this season. 15 goals pending. What are you saying? Little 3-0 win, walk in the park with you, wouldn't it? 1v1's, 50 1v1's, me and you and Wenzel, what? 50 1v1's, if you want me to ruin your career. Should we make the video happen? We'll make it happen. People want to see it. Make it happen if you want some views, I'll do that. Wednesday, 6 pm. Wednesday, 6 pm. If you want some views, you'll do it. <laughs> Bro, Massive if I see my time. name in that title, I want half commission. Come on, then. We'll make it happen. <laughs>